Fat Plate Golf are a relatively new company on the scene, uh, producing some feedback and trading aid uh, tools like this one that they've sent me through. This is the Fat Plate. Uh, this is going to help you, supposedly help you with ball striking to make sure that you're not hitting the ground before the golf ball. And if you do so, it's going to give you some feedback to let you know that you did. One of the problems that being at a driving range uh, kind of brings up really, if you're hitting the ground before the golf ball, sometimes the mat can disguise it. This little fella won't let you disguise it anymore. A uh, little strike plate here I believe is there uh, to show up if you're hitting the ground before the golf ball. Let's give it a test, let's see if it actually works. First impressions of the fat plate are really good. The packaging in particular uh, is very, very good. It almost looks like you've bought an Apple product or something like that. The packaging is fantastic. Not that the packaging really matters, but it is a nice little touch. Um, build quality looks fantastic. It's not cheap. It's not like a cheap perspex or anything. It looks quite thick. It's quite chunky. It looks like it's been built to last. Now this strip at the back here, I'm assuming again at the start uh, of the video I said that that was there to to show up whether you're hitting the floor before the ball, something that's very difficult to tell on at the range. Range mats tend to be a little bit too forgiving. Um, so this little fella's gonna tell you off if you hit the ground before the golf ball. So let's hit a couple of shots and see what this actually feels like to hit off. I've seen similar things to this in the past. That little bit of turf that they've put there feels really quite good to hit from. They've also put um, a couple of little markers down here on the mat to show you where to place the golf ball for different clubs. So if you've got short irons, mid irons, long irons, that's quite a nice touch. So obviously your angle of approach with a long iron is probably going to be a little bit more shallow. Uh, so therefore they're putting the ball a little bit further forward. Mid irons, sort of centre of this little hitting mat. Short irons, a little bit closer to the strike pad. It does feel very pleasant to hit from actually. It does feel good. It's not wobbling and moving around. There's a little bit of weight to it. Again, the Perspex is quite, quite good quality by the looks of things. And it's not moving around when I'm hitting the golf ball from it. So that's what happens when you're hitting some good shots. Let's see what actually happens if you do hit it fat. Now I'm gonna hit this one purposely heavy just to see if that little white strip shows it up. And it does exactly what it says on the tin. So you can see that it's gonna show you exactly where the ground was hit or the lowest point of the swing arc was. A really nice touch. I think if you're taking something like this to the driving range, you're going to get some feedback that you wouldn't normally get from a range mat. Uh, so if you are practicing ball striking, something like this, really useful. I think retails around about £65 mark, which isn't a lot of money uh, for something that is a quality product that could well help you with your ball striking. I'm going to hit a few more balls now and I'm going to give it a, a full review. Now, I'm not usually a massive fan of training aids, uh, but this little fat plate certainly does what it says on the tin. Gives you feedback when you hit the ground early. This little strike sticker that they've got back here called the strike strip um, certainly does its job. Tells you off if you hit the ground before the golf ball. Again, something that you do lose when you're at the driving range. And if you're using the range a lot through the winter months, I think it's really important to get feedback. This little hitting surface here seems very good quality. It certainly seems as though it's gonna last a long time. Uh, it's going to give you thousands and thousands of hits by the looks of it. I know a fair bit about artificial turf, I've bought quite a few uh, teaching mats in the past, and this certainly seems a very, very high quality. So overall, for £65, to some people that might seem like a lot of money, um, but you have to take my word for it because you can't feel or, or touch this thing, but the quality is exceptional. 
Um, for £65, if it's going to help you with your ball striking, it's worth every penny. If you like this review, please give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, make sure you do so. A little red button. Take care of yourselves and enjoy your golf.